New Orleans Mayor Latoya Cantrell wrapped up her final budget town hall tonight in Lakeview. There were plenty of homeowners there, plenty of questions, and a surprise. WGNO's Anna McAllister has the story at Lakeview Christian Center. Anna. Susie Kurt, Mayor Cantrell, answered many questions during the nearly two-hour town hall, including questions about crime, infrastructure, and trash pickup in the city of New Orleans. But it was her answer to the final question about the future of Mardi Gras 2023 that left attendees stunned. Dozens of people showed up for the final budget town hall for District A. The event hosted by Mayor Latoya Cantrell, Councilman Joe Geruso, and members of the mayor's staff addressed numerous questions from concerned residents, like the future of trash pickup in Lakeview and across New Orleans. We were able uh, to rebid and we've selected two contractors, that is Ivy Waste and Waste Pro, um, that will start November the 1st. As residents submitted their questions for Mayor Cantrell to answer, a commonality among department leaders was the ongoing issues with staffing shortages. We are currently operating with 60% of our current staffing. I want you to think about that for a minute. 60% of the number of EMS providers that we need to make the city safe and healthy. But the biggest topic on everyone's minds was crime and the dwindling police force at NOPD. And the men and women of the New Orleans Police Department continue to fight a good fight day in and day out. But there has to be some level of accountability thereafter. And the, the fact that our criminals do not believe there are consequences to their actions make them more bolder and brazen. But perhaps the most shocking moment of the event was the final question. When Mayor Cantrell was asked about public safety and the future of Mardi Gras 2023. If we don't have adequate police, it could mean that there will be no Mardi Gras. Uh, that's a fact. If our officers cannot be safe, then there's no way that our city will be safe. Mayor Cantrell also said that the NOPD is focusing on retainment and recruitment and is urging any New Orleanian who is interesting in protecting and serving the community to apply to the department. Kurt, Susie? Well, that's the first time we've heard next year's Mardi Gras be threatened by the lack of police. Yeah. Thanks, Anna.